Hello there. Welcome to the MailChimp tutorial. Today we will discuss about MailChimp. What is MailChimp? How does it work? How to sign up for MailChimp? How to create a campaign? How to check the reports? How to create an email template in it? And overall setup. So this is the MailChimp's website. It's MailChimp.com. You can sign up for free from here. There are various plans. In free plan, you can use up to 2000 email list. That means your contact or customer list of 2000 emails you can upload for free. For more than 2000 emails, you have to pick a paid plan. With MailChimp, you can send automated campaigns like if you want someone clicks on your email then you can send uh, them a, a specific email if they doesn't click then you can send a specific email suppose you want to send an email to them after 10 days of clicking one link of your email that's what you can do using the mailchimp automation mailchimp named it as customer journey we will discuss in the mailchimp series later on you can check the reports you can make the segments of your audience based on age based on tags based on other things that you want you can make email templates that stand out from the crowd and make them eye catchy to get more business from your customers you will get a free support of email uh, from MailChimp or if you are on a paid plan then you can have their chat support or 24 by 7 customer support there are lots of integrations like WordPress, Joomla, Shopify and other things you can add your website you can integrate your shop with MailChimp. So let's get started with a plan. To show you how to sign up, I will use the free plan for now. What is included in the free plan, you can check it out here and you can compare it with the other plans to make a better decision of what you really want. I am signing up for free for free plan right now. First you have to insert your email address. I am using my personal email address but it's always better to use a company email address like touch the email template.com I have already signed up using this email so I am using a personal email for now someone has already taken it so I have to change it You have to verify the email address to go forward. Has your MailChimp activation email? You can simply click it if you are on a same window but I am using a different browser so I have to copy paste this link. Now you have to give some basic information to MailChimp. I am continuing with the free.
you can choose your purpose from here You are set. Now you will go to your dashboard. We will learn about the left menu bar first. Here you see the create button. Clicking on it, you will be able to create regular emails, automations, website, the MailChimp hosted websites landing pages mailchimp hosted landing pages and other options like this sign up form survey advertise social post and postcards from the audience here you will be able to upload your contact list all contacts will show you the summary of all contacts uploaded here you will be able to see all of your uploaded contacts I will show in the next video how to upload your contacts in MailChimp. Here you will be able to add your sign up forms. Through the form, the people can subscribe to your newsletter from your website. Here are some options that we will discuss later in details. Tags. Here you can add customized tags for your contacts like January subscriber like Christmas subscriber or something else that you want to add we have the two text uh, three text here English subscriber New Zealand subscriber and May 2022 here you can add your segments what is segment suppose you want to separate the audience those clicked the specific campaign or something else that you can make separated from your whole list we segmented the people who did not open this campaign we segmented those who unsubscribed we segmented who did not open the last campaign and so on here you can add surveys and here you will be able to manage your one-on-one -one conversations with your subscribers next the campaign menu here you will be able to add campaigns the campaign is the main purpose of an email service platform like mailchimp we sent lots of campaigns and in the campaigns here you will be able to see the reports who opened how many people opened how many people clicked and you can see the details report here the difference between the generic platform like gmail outlook and the pro email service platform like this is basically the reports and automations like here you will be able to track your clicks track your bounce rates or anything else track your orders and you can see how many people clicked on which link like this email templates here you will be able to create and save your email templates for your campaigns like we have this 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 saved already this is one of my previous account so in my new account that i created today i will show you how to create email templates or how to manage email templates or how to import a customized html email templates in later videos have we were able to here you will be able to see the email analytics and here is the reports you can check it out at your end here's the automations here's the customer journeys we have a test customer journey but 
it did not activate it yet uh, suppose a people signed up in your list you want to send them a welcome email and if they click then you want to send them another email if they doesn't click then you can send them other mail or so on here you can automate many emails like this depending on the MailChimp plan you have here you will be able to see your saved journeys pre-built journeys and transactional emails here you will be able to add your website integrate your store and other setup setting appointments content studio here you will be able to upload your content like videos like images and other files to host and you can use them in your email templates or you can attach that files in your emails integration depending on your platform you can integrate your service here like this and there are lots of services that you can integrate with mailchimp like this and there are some resources under the mailchimp and co that you can check it out later i am not discussing them in details for now now we will upload our contact list here you have to go to audience dashboard Add your contacts. Click on the upload a file option or copy paste option or import from another service as you want or as, as it is feasible for you. So I am uploading it as a file right now. We have to upload a CSV or tab delimited TXT file. Continue. If you have a excel file like this you can convert it to csv and then upload it here i have the excel file and i just opened it on microsoft excel and you can see the file save as here you have to uh, select the csv format And the CSV is saved here. Here you can select the status as subscribed and click on the update in existing contacts to avoid the doubling here can i add any tags or not here you can select uh, the first column which is the name then you can select the first name uh, there is no full name option here so you have to either uh, use the first name or last name so we have a full name here saved uh, in the excel sheet but it should first name and uh, the b column is last name and the c column is email like this this is not a proper method to save a excel file we are adding it as a first name for now and the email address uh, point is ok and then click on finalize import then click on complete import you can either send a campaign or view your contacts right now here's the list is updated i will make a test campaign in the next video to show you how to create the campaigns and how to see the open rates and track other reports.
नेक्स्ट वीडियो विल बी पब्लिश सून यू कैन सब्सक्राइब माय चैनल टू गेट द अपडेट्स एज सुन एज इट इज अपलोडेड इन माय चैनल इफ यू हैव एनी क्वेश्चन प्लीज फील फ्री टू कॉमेंट बिलो और मेल आस एट टस एट द रेट ऑफ द ईमेल टेम्पलेट डॉट कॉम टिल देन हैव ए ग्रेट डे बाय बाय